So on this job here, what we're doing is replacing the TPR, temperature relief valve, because this is dripping here, very hot water coming out. And I thought, why is it dripping? And look down here, there's no thermostat. So the customer literally said the boiler is, the, the, the hot water is boiling hot always. He literally just turns it on and off from his hive app, but there's nothing to control the temp of the water. There's a safety device there missing. So uh, whoever installed this, not good whatsoever. So I'm here to fit the, fit it. The customer said he's bought one, which is here. We've got the, the valve here. So we change, you put in valve, start, and what I've done is I've opened up downstairs tap, open a tap downstairs. I'm going to hold this open with one hand. Yeah. I'm going to recharge this to free bar. That's open. Should have drained now to about here, roughly. So let's rip it off. So let's prep this. Yeah, I am using gas PTFE. It's the only PTFE I use. So part two of the job, valve's been fitted. Now we're gonna fit the stat. So we're gonna figure out how these guys are wired it up. Start off by taking this apart. Have a look at the connections inside here. So this right here is the cylinder thermostat. If you want more info on this you want to learn a lot more about this then i have got an s-plan course yeah so check the link on my bio by the s-plan course so let me get the multimeter out set it to continuity yeah so at the minute there's no demand but imagine that there was power from c to one which is here no demand at the minute. If I turn the stat up, yeah, it would transfer the power over from this probe to here. So essentially you've got power coming in from programmer. It then, then the thermostat switches on. It then transfers the power to here, which would then transfer it back to the zone valve. I presume they've just gone brown straight from the stat. So as soon as the stat gives it power, it goes straight to power to the zone valve. You've got this drive here. Go there. Outer, outer, right there. Yeah. So this is our hot water zone. One to gray is fine, but brown. They've gone into this one here. This one, black is from the stat. So if this is from the programmer, programmer will give power to this and then it's going straight into brown, which is giving power straight away to the zone valve. So there's no safety device in the middle, there's no thermostat in the middle. So on the other side of the room, I just found this here, found this on the other side of the room. So I think they were planning on wiring in, but they for some reason didn't. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this on to 
the bleeper and I'm just going to make sure that these are the same cable so brown to brown to brown so these are in fact the same cable so this is going to be all the way near the, near the cylinder so if you guys use my wiring guide which I've created on the S-Plan Pro guide this would be very easy now you'll be able to figure this out very easy so you've got this wire here from the stat I'm going to put this in here so it's going to the this black one now I'm going to connect this to the brown wire here this will be connected here 15 brown is going to go to brown So the way it's going to work is programmer is going to call for heat. It's then going to go down the blue wire, which is going to go to the stat, the common on the stat. And then the common on the stat is going to say, yep, I want heat. Give power to brown. Brown will then give power to zone valve, which then gives power to the orange. And then we have heat. Here's the cable on the other side, which I found. Remember always always remember to do this because i always forget this is probably the first time that i've not forgot i forgot to do it always push this through because you wire it do all the hard bit and then you forgot to push this through so that's been pushed through there like that let's get the stat and again it's a really bad design but i want to wrap earth around here So the way it would work is programmer gives power goes all the way up here to common thermostat calls for heat switches on power then goes down here onto the brown and then we have lift off Now, time to test. So that's off. That's calling for heat, yeah? So it's off. Let's turn fuse spur on. That's not even fuse spur. Fuse spur's here. Fuse spur on. Borders come on. So let's call for water. We're calling for hot water. Nothing should happen to us before. Once that button was pressed, zone valve opened straight away on the hot bit, it just it started heating the hot water straight away. Now nothing's happening, which is good. Turn this up. You can see there, zone valve's moving, allowing the water through. That's flashing. And voila, we now have added the thermostat to the system.